There are two applications I want to show you. The first one is here, and it is the remote viewer. If I open up the HMI in remote viewer, you can see that it is the same as what is on the HMI itself. Of course, it's sized to fit the screen appropriately. And as I press things on the Android application, you see that the same thing is happening on the actual HMI. So they're directly connected. We call this synchronized mode, where um, whatever you do on one product, you see happening the same thing happening on the other product. The other application I'd like to show you is Tablet HMI. And it's a different program in the Android. And I'll connect to this HMI physically. And it says press to start. So starting up the tablet demo. And what I'll do is I'll, I'll show the HMI screen and the tablet showing pretty much the same thing. But you can see there's a difference. This picture looks different from that picture. And that's because the one for the Android was developed specifically for the Android using the pixels that it has and uh, just to show that they're different. And I can do something like I can fill the tank and you can see the value increasing here as well as up here, right? And I can empty the tank and you can see it emptying. You also see it emptying there. And so they are connected. They're using the same variables even though the screens are different. And if I go to a different screen, you can see that I'm doing something to this screen and yet that screen's not changing, so you're not you're not interfering with the operation of the HMI itself. And yet if I go here, what I did on this screen really did something. It, it set a bit, and now I'm going to unset it, and you can notice that uh, the value is going to change, right? So oh, I have to hit reset. So hitting reset turns it off, and both of those are green. Hit set, it turns red. I can toggle a bit, right, and you can see the value changing. It changes in both locations.